Hey, what's up? Hello and welcome. My name is Maya and today we have an episode of Family Dynamics and I am super excited because I love this family. Um, of course, I played some days off camera like I mentioned last episode. If you're new here, uh, my name is Maya and I make Sims for Let's Plays and this is one of them. So if you enjoy it, don't forget to subscribe um, and ding the notification bell so you don't miss a video. But yeah, let's get started. All right. So like I said, I played some days off camera. It is Winterfest Eve. Of course, Jaden is playing video games because he just needs video games to deal with all the stress that's in his life. No, um, but he's still in school. He's doing computer science. Is he keeping up with his classes? No, because there's two days left in the term and he still did not do any of his work. He barely does his homework. I'm just hoping he doesn't fail this term, um, but he's lazy. He doesn't want to do anything. He still needs to refine and organize this. So time to get off the games, Jaden. You got stuff to do. Um, it is, like I said, Winterfest Eve. So, of course, Maddie is enjoying her time. Tomorrow is Ariella and Jaden's wedding. If I can get them married. I do not have the new pack because I didn't want to ruin their wedding um so that's why i didn't get the new pack but this is ariella and her little boy aiden i am waiting for her to have him in a safe position so we can pause and take a look all right here's little aiden he's so cute i think i don't know who he really looks like but i really want to say he looks like ariella like the head shape her lips i think he only has jason's eye color <laughs> like the darker eyes because ariella has like brown eyes too but just a little lighter, but he is so cute. So, so cute. He's been a joy to have in the house. It's nice to have like a little baby. It's been making me want Jason to have a kid so bad. Ariella chose to be a stay at home mom. Um, I did mention before that she's really smart. So she could make the decision to, oh, uh, he needs a bath, love. So can you give him a bath? Um, she did make the decision to stay at home to raise little Aiden, even though Maddie told her to go to work if she wants, go to school, do whatever you want. We'll take care of Aiden like we're a family. She's like, no, I want to see my son grow up. Um, plus, she's been really into painting. She went autonomously into this easel that I have in Jasmine's room and she's been painting. So she does contribute to the family, but um, she really wants to just be a mom first and focus on this part of her life. Um, she's also really sad well she was sad um because she lost her mother even though her family wasn't like too close to her and didn't um didn't accept her or aiden she still loves them so she does want to invite them to her wedding that she's gonna have this episode she is engaged to jason um but i did it through Cass, and it's not letting me plan their wedding so hopefully i can call tomorrow and plan the wedding um, Maddie, you're supposed to be doing stuff to get ready for Winterfest tomorrow because it's the wedding. Hello, your first child is getting married. So God, that's a big thing. So we should cook something for her wedding. You know, Maddie's cooking all the food. Um, first thing we need to do is we need to make a teared cake so they can have a wedding cake. Ariella has pretty much been on mommy duty, but um she did look at a house they decided to move to strangerville um because she knows that the restaurant is in strangerville she has been into cooking a little bit um and baking so yeah she's like i definitely want to help maddie with the restaurant so why not move to strangerville to help her she's so sweet um and her and maddie are getting a little closer so that's really cute all right my love how is this going it's normal is he going to really spend all his hard time on here no um as long as it's normal quality he's good same thing for his papers um, but he has class soon so i'm not gonna have him start it and jaslyn is home she is now a teen and she looks much older maddie's twin for real like i've been saying but she decided to dye her hair. Her and um, Dayton are still not getting along. I don't know what it is, but every time they're around each other, they argue. I did not do anything to change it. Um, they just do. I'm going to try to fix their relationship, but I, honestly, it's like so bad. Like they just can't even be in the same room. Where is Aiden at? Because he's sad and Auntie Jasmine wants to go in and help. See, she's going in to talk. Ask him if he's been good or bad. Like, have you been good or bad, little Aiden? Are you going to get gifts? 
all of the family has really stepped up and like embraced having Ariel in the house. Jaslyn and Ariel are even getting close. Um, Weston wants to hang out tonight. We do actually. I feel like Jaden has been stuck in the house. He's been like really just, he's not depressed anymore about Ariella since they got engaged. He's like, I'm just, I'm gonna leave it be. Um, they're happy together and he loves Aiden. He loves Aiden so much. He loves his nephew. I think he even has an adoring sentiment with him. Yeah, he adores his nephew. He just wants the best for Aiden um, and thinks he's like the greatest thing ever. Like it's made him so much more mature and he kind of wants it for his future. He's seeing like, Aiden and Jason in their relationship and Jason's relationship with Ariella. And he did pick up the single and loving lifestyle. He loves um, being single um, and he doesn't really want to pursue a relationship. All right. I think you have class now. Yeah. So go to class. Um, so once Ariella decided that's who she was going to be with, I mean, he was never an option. Like she never told him that she liked him or anything like that. He pretty much was like, you know what? I'm happy being single and doing what I got to do. So yeah, he likes being single. Let's see if we can comfort him. He's just so sad. He lost his grandparent. He didn't know that grandparent, but I feel like he's just more um, sad that he never got to meet them. And then also sad because his mom is sad and he loves his mom. So yeah, they're cute. What else can you make for this wedding? Should we add, we should add a wedding topper so no one eats this. Aw, and Jaslyn just gained a sentiment with Aiden. They're both, like, all the family is not happy that Aiden and Ariella are moving out. Jason, they're like, eh. Jason, yeah, we get it. You gotta, you know, leave. But Ariella and Aiden, they're like, no, don't leave. Oh, no, don't add birthday candles. Add a wedding topper. Don't leave. Like, we love having you here. And I think it's gonna put some pressure on Jaden. Maddie's gonna be like, so... When are you giving us a grandchild? Cause Aiden is great, but we need another one. We might have um, date and retire soon. I have been stingy cause I love the money that he brings in. Um, but yeah, we might have, oh, I, I got scared. I thought she was eating that cake. I forgot she was like eating her own cake. All right, you're good. All right, how about you, my love? You get some leftovers. I don't think you have any more classes today. Nah, you don't, but you do need to submit those papers because you only have two days left in the term which means that technically tomorrow is the last day because you have a final exam tomorrow actually he's probably like let's order some pizza mom you're like cooking everything for the wedding tomorrow and winter fest so of course he's gonna order a pizza because that's a part of his generation actually is to order pizza once a week i already did it off camera for the week but we can always use more pizza and let's get sweet corn because last time he got pepperoni and Jaslyn couldn't eat it. All right, it would be nice if Jaslyn and Ariella decorate together. But freaking, see, he has festering bitterness because Jaslyn's in the room. I don't know why they don't like each other, but they don't. And it's annoying, but they don't. No, don't. Oh, he ate one. That's for the wedding. Jaden, you ordered pizza. <sighs> so annoying. You might as well eat the souffle. All right, um, Maddie, now it's time to make some dishes. Their wedding, of course, is gonna be a winter wedding because we're in winter, even though it's not cold here. I believe we're gonna get married in Newcrest because there's a lot that's already in this save that I wanna check out. Um, but what should we make? I don't know, I don't know. Maybe some herb crusted salmon and then make a chicken option and then a vegetarian option. Maddie's like super excited that they're getting married. Jason looks so handsome in his his uniform. Like, look at our military officer. All right, he did get a promotion off camera. He is now the fourth lieutenant, so he's an officer. He went on that track. Um, he's taking his pizza. Oh, and Maddie's now level six. She can make rack of lamb. Oh yeah, we're definitely making rack of lamb for the wedding. Having all these people is not fun though. That's one thing about having Aiden and Ariel in the house. It's so many people. Um, that's one thing I'm going to be excited for when they leave is that less people in the house. I feel like Jason came home with presents for little Aiden. So he's like, shh, shh, he's asleep. Let me go put the presents under the Christmas tree. Cause Aiden just took himself to bed. He was like, I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Oh, Aiden is starving. He's so smart though. He's going in to get pizza for himself. So cute. I've been holding off on Ariella getting pregnant again and making her like take birth control. But I really want them to have a daughter, so they need to, like, you know, get a move on it. Maybe we should 
decorate with um with jason that would be cute oh so cute i got little oh look at the uncle and nephew watching a movie together i love them i got a little um christmas outfit well i didn't get a little christmas outfit i already had the christmas outfit um for aiden to put on so we might do a little photo shoot with him i feel like maddie's like i need photos of my baby for my wall before he leaves so yeah let's get a move on that so we're gonna get pictures of him Jaden, you're sitting here watching movies and i know you want to be a great uncle but you got papers to submit and even though it's christmas you do have a final exam so we got to do that is this one good it's normal so let's submit the normal quality one i feel like Jaden is definitely someone that says um c's get degrees and he's just like it's fine we're fine oh are you gonna go play with jaslyn while your parents fix up the tree how sweet is that oh jaslyn's being a great auntie so cute maybe we can get jaslyn to be the one to take the picture of him oh no Jaden lost his celebrity level he's probably so pissed he keeps saying that school is messing up with his like celebrity life ah if he could he'll drop out but Aiden looks so cute this is the little Christmas outfit I gave for him he kind of looks like his dad when his dad was this age I'm pretty sure we do have a toddler picture of the boy so we can check it out Aww, our little elf is so cute all right Jaslyn go eat because you just complain about everything take your slice um please put him down oh my goodness of course you're putting him to bed he wanted to get excited over the presents jason's like it's bedtime it's late why do we have him up i feel like jason is like such a strict dad because he's uh in the military he's kind of like you know he needs a routine he needs structure no he should be in bed all right then he's like all right dad if i if i have to go to bed at least read me a story. So we'll have Jason read him a story. Oh, Maddie's coming down like Jason or Jaden. You haven't been down up upstairs in a while. We're getting ready for the wedding. And he's like, university. So that's what I'm doing. Okay, Jaden's papers look good. So let's submit both of them. And she's like, are you doing well with university then? You don't really, I don't see you doing the work. And he's like, I'm doing it right now. <laughs> Maybe he can talk to her about his streaming milestones first. Like, you're worried about school. What about streaming? I did like the cash out thing for him. And he had freaking, he had 2,000 and like 700 simoleons for the week for streaming. So he's doing pretty well. And he's probably like, I don't really need to be in school because I can just stream to get money. Um, and that's just how he feels about it. Did you submit both term papers? Okay, you did. And then tomorrow we need to take our final exam and give a presentation. And that is it. I did want the boys to go out to celebrate um, Jason getting married. But I think they're both exhausted. Like he's up here doing some last bit decorating. And um, his fiance and his baby sleep. So he's kind of like, eh. I kind of just want to go to bed and be there for my family. I'm excited for tomorrow. Did you eat the souffle after I brought the pizza? Why are they eating the wedding food? That is so annoying. Um, But let's make, where is it? Her famous mango sticky rice. That was a hit last time. It's so cute that Dayton and Maddie are up. Just like, you know, vibing. Let's um go over there and do a little flirt for her. Like, you look beautiful. Look at you making dinner, of course, like always. The romance has been like, eh, for them. Um, The reason for it is because they've both been so sad. And you know, like when the Sims are sad, they can't flirt. So their romance has just been like trickling down because they've been dealing with so much loss, so much death. Um, Friends dying, family dying, everyone dying. So yeah. What else do you want to do? Try for baby with Madison. See, this is how I know they want grandchildren because y'all both are elders. How can you try for a baby with her? Um, and I guess she's not talking to you because she's cooking. But this is the first time they have not been sad in a long time. So I think after she's done making the mango sticky rice, that's the last thing she needs to make. I think they're going to have a nice little woohoo for bed time. Oh, they're so cute as ever. Um, on that note, though, we'll let them finish off their woohoo. And we will pick back up in the morning with Christmas. I'm so excited. Um, this is the first Christmas we've had since they had that Christmas all the way in Maddie's first place. 
So I'm excited. All right, Aiden just reached potty level two, but it's the next morning and um, Jaden is working on homework because he does have his final exam today. He submitted all papers, did all, oh no, he needs to do his presentation. When does that open up? Oh, he can do that now. So we'll send him to do his final presentation. Poor Aiden is starving, but grandpa's making grand breakfast because Maddie was tired. So he let her sleep, but Maddie, it's time to get up. Breakfast is done. Let's put it on the table. Jaslyn, well, you can't even eat breakfast anyway. So yeah, go ahead, eat your little fruit pie. Everyone come eat, good morning. This is so cute. The um, wedding is at 12, I think today or one. So we're gonna have the family um, open gifts here, celebrate Christmas and then have the wedding. Let's see if I can talk to Jaslyn without her um, hating us. Oh, also Dayton is sad because Cameron True passed away, who was Maddie's friend. Oh my goodness, he has his final exam in an hour. He better hurry up and finish giving his presentation. Oh, we can wish to be happy in his couple. Yes, we could be like, it's your wedding day, aren't you happy? Oh, Maddie's like, yay, my family. Love her. I was going to wait until um, Jaden got home from his exam, but he is starving. So we're gonna let him eat because his exam is coming up. But I think I'm gonna have the rest of the family open up gifts. Aw, Aiden got a penguin television. I'm just putting the food for the party in our inventory so we don't forget it. Oh wow, Ariella got a PC. All right, Jaslyn, what did you get? Jaslyn got a PC too? Aw, Dayton only got a wolf ill. He was like, I don't want that. What, what is that? Oh, go to your final exam, please. Go to your final exam, please. Go, 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 go. Good luck, my boy. Aw, that's so cute, the girls all talking. I was gonna have one of them do the dishes, but I guess we'll have Jason do it. Oh, he's opening his gift. The wedding's gonna start soon. Oh my goodness, Maddie got a robot vacuum and Jason got a camera. That was a pretty good gift. He didn't like it, but that was still like, I think a really good Christmas. Oh, the maid is here. I got a maid because Maddie and Dayton are getting older. They don't have time to be cleaning all the time. And she's so nice, love her. Um, He wasn't too happy about his gift. She's gonna go cry about it. That's fine. That is fine. How's everyone doing for the wedding though? And Jaden is back, but he's like, okay, there's no presents for me. Can someone add a present pile so he can get something? Let's have Ariella do it. She's like, I didn't forget about you. The wedding should be starting. I'm confused. Hopefully I made it on the right day. I did. Oh, see, okay, no, the wedding is starting now. Well, you can't get, you gotta wait to get your present, Jaden. Let's go start the wedding. I'm so excited. All right, so we're here at the wedding lot. I decided to come to a church for their wedding. I never do weddings in churches. And I thought I was gonna go to this outdoor wedding lot that's in Newcrest, but I saw that this was an option as well. And I was like, ooh, a cathedral. Yeah, they can get married in a church. Um, I think that would be cool. So this is where they're gonna have their wedding. Um, yeah, I, I kind of want to get things started right away because we have a lot to do. Um, this is where I decided to put all the food. You see all the food out here. Um, I'm just going to give it a minute so more people can show up and then we'll get married. Oh, Ariel is in here dancing. She's like, I want to have a great wedding. Her juices. This is a cute church though. Oh, look, Maddie. Okay, I don't know why Jaslyn's doing sit-ups in her beautiful dress, but Maddie's out here teaching Aiden some flashcards. Like, she's like, it's always a moment to learn. Oh, he's so cute. Like, look at that face. Yeah, Ariella's face through and through. Don't worry, you all, we're gonna get them pregnant again. <laughs> I'm so serious, but I'm glad she's in here enjoying herself. I invited her family. I invited like friends. I know a lot of them don't have formal outfits because yeah, I never gave them formal outfits, but Kaysen is here. This is, um, he looks awful, awful. They look so awful. Oh my goodness. I'm so embarrassed. I usually have like everyone all dressed for weddings. Um, can we get some fruit punch? Jaslyn, my love, you're still feeling hungry, so. Come in here and grab a serving of rice. 
Harley's here. At least I gave Harley a Forma outfit. She looks so cute. If you don't remember, Harley is Jaslyn's friend who she likes. Um, so let's go talk to her. She's her little crush. She's so cute. It's something with this family and liking their friends, but whatever. Too cute. I think it's almost time to do their ceremony at least. Oh, cute. Aiden is in here sitting watching his mom and grandma dance. All right, let's get them married though. Because she's starting to get sad. Thinking about her mom, that her mom's not here at the wedding. Actually, let's wait and see if her family shows up. If they don't show up, that's going to be so sad. All right, so yeah, some guests are out here. We have one of her brothers. This one is Brody Conley. I think he's the one that called her and called her a disappointment. Um, we also have some of Jaslyn's friends. I love that Jaslyn's friends are the only ones that like I seem to get dressed up. Oh, and Evan Keller as well. I think... Why is he still a teen? He should be an adult by now because he grew up with um, Ariella and them. Um, but people are showing up, so we might as well get married. Everyone that matters is here. So let's get wet, um, married to Jason. And I'm going to have, of course, the whole family come in here and attend the, we the wedding. All right, come on, everyone. Come in here. Attend the wedding. Let's make this cute. Oh, wait, I know what I want to get. All right, I was in Build By buying uh, a camera to take a picture of them. And Jason finished the term with the A minus. How? I don't know. He only had a C in one class. I told you all. I said Jason. Definitely Jaden. I told you all. Jaden is um, someone that's just naturally smart, even though he's lazy and doesn't try. He could have got an A plus in everything if he applied himself. Um, it's not letting me sign up for another term, um, but we can take pictures of the wedding. Um, but are you going to come? Why are you chatting with Kaysen? Go get married. But I wanted to take photos. No, what does he do? I can at least take photos of the bride by herself. If you don't know, this is Ravishine's, um mod that lets you take photos without needing anyone to control the camera. And it's like such a lifesaver. It makes capturing these moments so much easier i purposely didn't want to get the wedding pack to not make this wedding glitchy and the fact that it's still glitchy get married oh my goodness are they actually going to get married i just at this point why is everyone dancing like this is not the time to be dancing is this finally it are they finally getting married with people dancing in the background this is her other brother at least he's here Okay, they are getting married. Everyone's just in the background. That's fine. I don't even care. Let's take a photo. Of course, it's when they stop doing the, the cute things. I'm gonna catch something. Oh, her dad did come. He's over here. I swear. I'm literally just catching them staring at each other and it's starting to annoy me. Are they sitting? They are. Oh my goodness, I keep missing the interactions and it's annoying me. I'm gonna get it, y'all. I'm gonna get it. I think I got it. I did it! I did it, y'all. I did it. Oh, this is so cute. Look how happy they are. <laughs> I'm not crying. I'm not crying. Welcome to the Waller family, Ariella. So cute. If these are not in my um, inventory, I'm gonna scream. All right, what a beautiful ceremony. They exchanged their vows, how cute. Aw, everyone got up immediately and was like, let me stand in front of the camera, even though I want to get this. No, I didn't. I got it, I got it. I mean, Ariella looks crazy, but this is still their, their wedding kiss. Aw, how cute. They are married. That took um, forever, but let's get this party started. No, everything's spoiled. Did the wedding cake spoil? Not yet. We have six hours on the wedding cake. Um, let's cut the wedding cake. Let's at least do this then. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. LOL, LOL. Yeah, I should have like gotten a fridge or something. Oh, well. Maddie made all that food for literally no reason. Is there a way I can cheat and make the food like not spoiled? I wonder. Um, yeah, I can make fresh. Yes, I'm cheating less. 
or we'll have no food. Aw, everyone's celebrating. Hopefully this really makes it fresh. Okay, yes, it is. Now they can eat it. It just looks stinky. Are you gonna go like smash the wedding cake in his face or share the wedding cake with him? Okay, yeah, she's gonna go in there and she's gonna put wedding cake in his face. Ooh, I wonder if I can get it on the camera. They're in the way. They're in the way. You guys need to move. I wanna get this on the camera so bad. No, because Weston is in the way. I mean, your face looks beat, Weston, but you're literally in the way of happy. <gasps> oh no, I can move. Never mind, Weston. You can stay there looking gorgeous as ever. This is the cutest picture of my life. Now you see why this mod is everything. Like, ah, I love it. Oh, how cute. All right, now, yeah, go to the bathroom before you pee yourself at your wedding. Um, Maddie, you're going to pass out. Oh, I was going to call everyone to a meal, but they're in here eating anyway without us telling them. And their food looks stinky, but it's not. Okay, it's not. Jaden, you're not really hungry, but we haven't seen Weston in a little bit. So let's go in there and talk with him. Maddie, this might be the last time you see Honey, so let's make sure we can... Um, Talk with her, maybe wish her, wish her a Merry Christmas. Um, Ariel, is your dad still here? Before you leave, you should talk with your dad. They don't have the best relationship, um, but he's going to die soon. So at least wish him like a Merry Christmas. Her brother is here too. I believe this is one of her brothers, yeah. Anthony she has three brothers and she's the only girl so I think that's really what it was I think they were like you're supposed to be like in college and doing all these things but I think them seeing her get married they were like you know he's not a bad guy oh at least they get to talk on her wedding day how sweet she's probably like you know Aiden is getting really big we're moving to Strangerville you can come visit him anytime you want even though the food looks stinky, I think for the most part, this was a successful wedding. All right, I think we're going to end the episode off here, though. I'm so happy that uh, Jason and Ariella finally got married. We will be moving them out. So next episode, they won't be in the house anymore. It's just going to be Maddie and Dayton, Jocelyn and Jaden in the house. So it's going to be a much smaller house. Um, but I think we sent them off well. Next episode, we're going to focus more on Jaden. I know I say that every episode and then we focus on the family, but honestly, it's a family dynamics challenge. The family is a big part of the challenge, um, but we did get him to have an A minus in his first semester. He has one more semester to go and then he's done with college. Woohoo. And he can start his career and move on with his aspiration. That's really why we haven't been playing with his aspiration because he needs to join the career and we can't do that. And then um, the second thing is we're going to work on his skills. His skills are pretty good. Um, I think he's like six programming and eight video gaming. So we'll definitely get to level 10 by the end of his generation. Um, but next episode, I think I want him to start dating around a little bit. I know he's going to meet his spouse at GeekCon. Um, and if GeekCon is not next episode, I think it would be cute if we get him like maybe a girlfriend or something. He's never had a girlfriend and I kind of don't want his forever like wife to be his first girlfriend i think he should date around plus he's single and loving it so we might as well enjoy his single life by dating around i might use the simda dating app so that's gonna be fun next episode but i had so much fun and if you did too let me know down below and i will see you in the next one bye now